What's going on? Welcome back to Savage Antics. In this video, I wanted to customize my Insurgent pickup truck. All right. I'm not sure if you guys know this. There's a lot of new players out there, so I want to share this with you the entire process. So if you bought the Insurgent pickup truck, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to call Pegasus, okay? So once you call Pegasus, this Hello, allows you to pick Pegasus all these different, you know, help? weaponized vehicles, helicopters that you might own, planes, boats, etc., monster trucks, trucks, and your submarine. So the Insurgent pickup truck is under weaponized, and we're so going to click that. Vehicle is available for collection okay. right now. We hope you're very happy, sir. Call so again. since I Goodbye. already own it, it doesn't cost me anything. Okay, so I'm able to summon it, no problem. So once I click on the pickup to have it delivered, they drop it on the mini map. And as you can see, it is right here somewhere. I could have swore they just moved it on me. Uh, it is right here on the mini map. Okay. So here we go. I'm in the insurgent. Now you do have to have someone else man the gun up on top. But what we're going to do is we are going to call the Avenger, all right? So then we come down here to services, we go to Avenger, and we request our Avenger. So now we have to wait again on the Avenger to be delivered, okay? So it has been delivered right next to me, holy smokes. Literally right next to me. <laughs> that was convenient. All right, so once your Avenger gets delivered, you simply drive up to the back of it and press right on the D-pad. That will put your insurgent inside the back of the Avenger. So I have absolutely no clue how I'm gonna customize this, so bear with me and we'll get it done. So we're immediately gonna upgrade it to weaponized. I have no idea what this costs, holy smokes. Insurgent pickup truck custom two hundred and two thousand dollars. So we just upgraded it. Boom. I don't know what changed before we customize it anymore. Okay, so it looks like I have window grates all the way around. You know what? I'm gonna exit this. I wanna see what this thing looks like before we do anything else. This just cost us two hundred grand. Let's see what all we get. And of course, it's you know, it's always dark when I'm filming these videos for you guys. It doesn't I don't plan that. It just kind of works out that way. All right, so it looks like we have some a little bit of armor plating on the windows. Uh looks like there's a roll cage enhanced. It looks like the tires are a little bit bigger as well. I don't know if that's true or not. But it does look a little bit beefier. All right, not bad, not bad. 200 grand. Pull up to the back, hit right on the D-pad, and let's load back in. I have no clue what I'm going to do with this one. Maybe I'll do it the, uh, alright, armor plating. We'll just go full on armor plating. Looks like that put armor plating behind the guy up on top too. Nice. Alright, brakes. We'll do racing brakes, 35,000. We're doing everything, minus the horn. We'll do the, the headlights, neon kit. Let's do, of course, front, back, and sides, 30,000. This is a lot more expensive than I thought. Let's go with, pick a good color here. Let's do the black light crew color. Let's go black light. Ooh, a livery. All right, here we go. We'll make it the same as we did that, uh, ooh. There's a lot of good ones. I kind of like this naval geometric. I do like that white camo, though. I'm going to do the white camo. License plate. We'll just do the free one. I don't know what the difference is really. Proximity mines. Of course, we're going to do proximity mines. That's another 100 grand. Respray it. Primary color. Let's 
go metallic. I'm gonna do the olive green. Secondary color, let's go metallic. Let's see what olive green looks like. Keep it all the same. Did I pass it? Olive green. Yeah, I'm gonna go olive green. Try to keep it looking clean. All right, suspension, of course we're gonna lower it, competition suspension. Of course we gotta do the transmission and a turbo. Acceleration is maxed out, nice. Weapons, machine gun or 50 cal minigun? Uh, I think we're gonna have to upgrade to the 50 cal minigun. Holy smokes. This thing is gonna be so much better now. Wheel type, off-road, stock. Oh, that looks good. Mudslingers. We're going with this one. I don't know why. Those just stood out to me. Wheel color. Let's see what that... We're going all of all the way around. Yeah, I'm going to do it. So basically, this is the exact same as the Night Shark I used to have before I did that Kobe Bryant tribute. Tire design. Custom tires, tire enhancements, they're already bulletproof. Tire smoke. Do we have a green? Windows. Of course, we're going to limo tint them. And that's it. So that did cost us quite a bit of money. I'm not exactly sure how much money. But uh, we got proximity mines. We have 50... Oh, that looks good. Way better than before. Holy smokes. I had no idea you could even customize this insurgent. Now, you do have to load up with the, you know, your team, your crew or whatever. Look at this. These guys are fighting over here. Let's see if I can pick him up. <laughs> so he's fighting uh, these two guys over here. So now he's in here with me. Hop in. Oh, he's up on top. Yeah. Looks like they were tag teaming him. That's so funny how I got this on video. I just randomly parked up to some random guy, let him jump in, and now these two guys that were tag teaming him are now a 2v2, and they're getting destroyed. Somehow I must have made it so he couldn't get in. <laughs> uh, all right guys, so I'm gonna end that for this. I ran over my own minds. I'm gonna end this live stream here. I really appreciate you guys checking out this video. Oh, he's down under the bridge. Make sure to subscribe. And if you guys see a guy getting tag teamed 2v1 make sure to help them out and that's all i got for you guys thanks